Samantha, welcome to Eye on the Desert. Today, I wanted to have you on to talk about voice acting and voiceovers, because this is something that was virtually unimpacted by the pandemic because it was already being done from home. That's exactly correct. For years now, voice actors audition from home. They do their jobs from home. And so what the pandemic um, has done, I guess, is now broaden the opportunity for people interested in in studying voice acting. Now you can literally live anywhere in the world and start training in this uh, really fun, fascinating, creative field. You've done this for years, but you really have uh, kind of thrown yourself into the teaching side of it. Uh, It's more than just being able to have a pleasant speaking voice. It is literally voice acting. And so Voice Tracks, the school that you founded, helps students not only uh, hone their voice, but you also help them find opportunities as well, correct? Exactly. And um, I mean, I take my teaching very seriously, Um, you know, mine, but also the high pedigree of instructors that we have. If you want to learn cartoons, you're going to be learning from Pinky in the Brain or the star of Animaniacs or the Tick. If you want to learn documentaries, you're going to be taught by Peter Coyote. You know, all these people will now come into your own living room, bedroom, home office to teach. But I also have a lot of students that maybe aren't interested in getting into voice acting, but they're just simply trying to build their confidence or find their true voice. Because you learn an awful lot about yourself when you're studying voice acting, because it's all about learning to communicate authentically. And it's learning to become a great listener And it's learning to embrace who you are, embrace your voice, and learn to communicate that. So people come for all sorts of reasons. Very good reasons. But you're the right person to come to because you literally wrote the book about it. It's called Finding the Bunny. And that's been optioned by Warner Brothers. That's fantastic. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you very much. They, um, Well, you know, I've led kind of a colorful life. And they were fascinated with that. They're fascinated with the school and the community that Voice Tracks is. Um, they're fascinated with the idea of voiceover. Uh, so yeah, I feel really blessed. The book is called Finding the Bunny. It's available at all of the major book seller outlets, Amazon, et cetera, correct? Yes. And folks can find you. I'm going to put up all the information for voice tracks on KESQ.com. But if you're at least a bit interested in voice acting, Samantha, you're a great resource. And I think our viewers are going to love the opportunity to reach out to you. You'll be able to sign up by going to the link I'm going to put on KESQ.com. Samantha, lovely to see you again. We, it's good to oh, reconnect. Thank you. Take care.